Greetings, Internet, and welcome back to our Pokemon Sweet Nuzlocke. Last time we made our way down Cycling Road to uh, the Poke Sweet equivalent to Future City. We are now in the Poke Sweet equivalent to the Safari Zone, and we are looking for a lost child. And we found the Yarr looking for Choco Bun Pirates here. You know, it's Jake and the Poke Sweet Pirates. Yarr, ye again. It'd be time for a rematch. Yarr, pirate stuff. Yarr. <laughs> Pirate Dart would like to battle. He's got a Tartortal and a Cinnaworl. So we know all about Cin or, uh, Tartortal, who is nice and apple type, which makes Coco a bad idea. Hmm. So. Why don't we get. Actually, am I on Coco's turn? Yes. <laughs> Let's get Coco out of there. And we'll send Truffle out. Meanwhile, Ooey Gooey can double kick the hell out of the Cinnaworld, because it looks like a chocolate type to me. Bam! Bam! It is, in fact, a chocolate type. <laughs> oh no! Bubbles! Bubbles! <laughs> Apple toss. Apple is also super effective against Cherry. That's a thing that I just did. Alright, so why don't we Mud Pie you and Hyper Beam! Brah! <laughs> oh, not enough to take out the Tar Turtle, but it is in fact enough to take out the Cinnaworld. Bye, chocolatey goodness. Excuse me. What else you got, Pirate? A Mawana. Don't you bite, Truffle. Alright, so we need to get rid of the Tartortle, because Ooey Gooey must recharge. The Hyper Beam was just too hyper and too much. So bye bye, Tartortle. We'll see you later. Aw, oh, no levels. Flurry Blitz. Look at you with your banana moves. Alright, enough. We get it. We get it. Of course, it hit five times. Hmm. So, banana is weak to, I believe, apple, orange, and lemon. None of which I have out at the time. So, why don't we do that? And another hyper beam. Ooey gooey, so fast. Ooey gooeyness, slipping and sliding all around. This should be enough. Yep. Goodbye, Moana. Ooey gooey and truffle. Couple of my favorite Pokemon. Washed away, Yar. Yar, why ye be doing that? You suck. My terms. Yar, us pirates love us some pie. Man, the coolest pie I've seen was the pie duck. It's two Poke Sweets now that I really want and haven't been able to get. Hello. Meringle. Oh, of course. Okay, so the Meringle, I believe, is lemon or lime. So we will keep Coco in for now because they're level 24 and 29 and we're ridiculously over leveled. Meanwhile. How do I. Uh, hmm, must have not had full PP when the episode started. Pin Mizzle, what is Apple Week to Strawberry and Raspberry? We don't have any raspberry. We are part raspberry. So why don't we we'll just do a roller hyper beam? Or it shocked the tar turtle. Or the uh Meringle, not the tar turtle. Bye Meringle. <laughs> and who's your last Poke Sweet? A turtle. Oh, we got one of those. <laughs> There's a smoking lemon. Ah, oh, so close. That's right. You apple toss ooey gooey. Ooey gooey, you're getting a little low on health, actually. I think it's time for a heals. Because we don't need to lose you. We almost lost you last episode to the ex surprising explosion that it had me like, whoa, wait, wait, whoa, whoa, what's happening? Oh, wait, I need to recharge. Oh, that's fine. Because this should take out the total. Oh, critical hit. You're the best, Coco. In love with your coco. <laughs> ah, 
My throat is nice and extra dry today, just the way I like it. I'm trying to learn... Okay! Sure, you can learn Flamethrower. Okay. <laughs> oh, no. Alright, so, I mean... What's the least useful here? I mean... I can't look at your stats right now, but... Part of me says Hunger Touch, because it's only 15, where this is 60, and it may cause flinching. But this may cause Polka Sweets to get hungry. But then again, we've never really used it, so... You know what? Goodbye, Hunger Touch. Hello, Flamethrower. <laughs> I don't know, I don't choose. That's weird, though. The water type... That's actually really funny when you think about it, because Weasel initially is a water type, and in Pokemon we, we sweet Pokemon Sweet, excuse me, Pokemon Sweet, he's turned into an orange type, which so far has shown electric moves in like Orange Shock, but then out of nowhere learns Flamethrower. So you know what? I know it won't do a lot, but let's do it. Why not? Flamethrower! <laughs> Light of the land of sweets on fire! It's not very effective, my foot. <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. The pirate Daros has been defeated. Not in. No, you're not in me face! You're no, not the face! <laughs> yeah. So now, we could go ahead and heal Ui Gooey. Oh, Jesus. Oh, another one of those in the middle of the day yawning sessions. Love those. Alright, so they were blocking my path, so something must be over here. Like this house. What's in the house? Surrounded by smiling pumpkins. Oh, hello. Yarber, yeah, stay out of order, boy. It's Boston cream pie in the face. Or banana cream pie yarn, not Boston cream. That'd be weird and delicious. I would love Boston cream pie right now. You oh, he's got a cream puff and a bad barrier. Go, go, and ooey, gooey. Hmm. So you're weak to orange, so I kind of just want to light you on fire. And, oh, wait, there's no, 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 no. And I guess we'll just double kick the cream puff for now. Oh, is it enough? Is it enough? It is enough! Ah, oh, I love Coco. I love so many of these Poke Sweets. They did a really good job. The only one so far that I've been kind of disappointed in it was the Chansey equivalent, which was just like, hey, we're going to rip off your ears. Now you're an egg. That's just a little weird. But besides the point, other than that, they did a great job. Let's just go ahead and keep lighting things on fire. Um, should we see if Pin Missile does more? Nah, let's just keep double kicking you in the face. For now, Cream Tough. Yep. So we got a 32 and a 28. We're still at least 10 levels higher, and I feel really stupid and bad about that. Because <laughs> it's supposed to be super challenging. That's like, but. Oh, oh, hello, Torturing. I've noticed overall, this game is relatively easy. Like, there's. I mean, we've only lost Sturzel that once and other than that like we've had times like I haven't been this ridiculously over leveled the whole game there have been times going into the gym and all of a sudden I'm like oh shit we're like right on par and we've had some very very close calls too like we've I mean we've essentially almost lost our entire team but you know we've ne I haven't had a point where it's like I've lost like three Poke Sweets in one go around and have had to, you know, rethink it. But I mean, that's fine, you know, because it's still a little challenging, but gives me a chance to enjoy the game still. <laughs> ah, if only Double Kick hit more than twice. Who'd you just put to sleep? Or would you put them both to sleep? Put Coco to sleep? Why would you put Coco to sleep? Are you not in love with the Coco? Are you jealous? 
of Coco's greatness. Uh, Sandstorm almost took you out. Actually, you just used a pin missile. Coco is fast like sleeping like, I'm in love with myself, self. <laughs> uh, goodbye. No more levels. Pirate Ross. It's in me face instead. Yar, I got banana cream pie on me face. Yo ho ho and a bottle of banana cream. Hi, how are you? Yeah. Yar, you walk the plank for this. Yar, I'm going to just... Even though we're not in the ocean or anything, if I boot you off the plank, then you'd be more like just kicking you over and then you're on the ground and Coco is still asleep. I should have done something about that, Yar. <sighs> These levels. Like, the last guy had a 32. And these guys are sitting at 26 and 24. So one of the things I was talking about with this game is their levels are ridiculous. Like, I think the last, the last gym leader had higher levels than this. So it's like they completely prepare you for... Uh, let's see if you're part chocolate. You are, in fact, part chocolate. But, um... You know, they're like, oh, you gotta get high level for the gym. But then we're just gonna throw a bunch of weak trainers at you. So, I mean, unless that's the point. <laughs> like they're saying, you know, these pirates are just that bad. Like, they're a threat, but they're not. And you're just gonna easily sweep through them every single time. Who knows? Coco knows Flamethrower now, and that just makes me happy. <laughs> because these guys seem to mostly have banana types, which is perfect. And then sometimes their banana types have part chocolate. Well then, and then they have a swell peep, which throws everything out of whack. Um... Because I'm guessing, since it's blue, that it's a blueberry type, which is weak to strawberry and lime. So perhaps, who's coming out to play? Cream Puff. That's it. Like, look at that. That's a level 8. Why do you have a level 8? We have four badges. We should not be wasting our time with level 8s. That's just dumb. Okay, well, I'm going to leave Coco in. Because, why not? But then, we're actually going to give Ui Gooey a break. And I'm going to let Crisp come out. Level, like, we're fighting a level 26 and a level 8 right now. The 26 is like, whatever, we're kind of used to that. But the level 8, why do you have a level 8? Oh. Well, I guess I didn't need to bring Crisp out after all. Oh, well. You, you're going to need way more than that, buddy. We're 30 levels ahead of you. 30 of them. We're going to breathe on you, and you're going to die. Okay, I was going to say, if one bite does not take out a level 8... Ooh, we all got... Dolza was defeated. Yar, you ran me through! Yeah, well, you had a level 8. You, you should be ashamed of yourself. Why is the evolution music happening right now? If I sit here and wait, it's going to go... Bring. No, I don't think so. It's just going to keep looping. I already told you, you, my Pokesuite ate the prize. Please don't hurt me. Yar, what be this? A child trounce me crew? Be that as it may, he won't be lasting much longer against me, the captain of the Black Sugar Pirates. This boy stole the prize we rightfully took. Without it, we can't sail the Milky Seas. We might have a vessel by now. But me crew is so bad. But a pirate is not judged by his crew's potent. He is judged by their loyalty. Is your crew loyal to ye? Your crew had a level 8. <laughs> hey look, it's Archie. <laughs> With his pink hat. Lemon drop and gum tick, huh? Are you much better? Oh, okay, at least you're in the 30s. You have to have... 
Why do you have to have that? Hmm. Let's try it. Let's see what happens. <laughs> Did a lot, but it's not very effective. Ah, yes. That would be correct. <laughs> Alright, whatever. It still did a lot of damage. Well, at least this seems to be hitting five times. <laughs> oh, look at the gum tick with the cool green beard of awesome withdraw. Okay. You withdraw all you want. So we're going to go ahead and flamethrow the lemon drop this time. And then we'll double kick the gum tick. <laughs> oh, it makes me so happy. Super effective. Oh, that's right. You're not a lime type. Well, everyone's hovering around 39 now. Oh, never mind. We go. We just grew level 40. Now the official highest member, I believe. I don't think anyone else is level 40. Well, at least you have a, almost a full team of six. Uh, whipped up a sandstorm. Blah blah blah. Bam. Bam. <laughs> All right, razor lime. That was super effective. Oh, stop! You're on the card. Damn it! <laughs> now we all get buffed. I, I just I don't understand how it gets buffed by its own sandstorm. But we're gonna go ahead and light it on fire, and then we'll double kick that again. Yay for lighting things on fire! <laughs> uh, bye bye, you little lemon with the giant white thing on it. Uh, who else you got? Oh, I just got a cup cat. Bam! Ha! <laughs> Getting the crit! Way to go, ooey gooey! Yay, ooey gooey! Hmm, gain 513, 513 for everybody! So the cup cat and the gummerang. For all that's left. And of course we still gotta deal with the sandstorm, which we all get buffed by. Which is just great for everybody. <laughs> yeah, I don't really see the point in the um that thing having sandstorm. Uh should I just double kick it? I can't hyperbeam it. Yeah, let's just double kick it. Fidel is not weak to or super effective against anything, so for now, I'm gonna just mow him on down. So I'm guessing the special treat is Surf. I wonder if we even have anyone that can learn that on the stream. I kinda wish I had caught the Pie Duck, because I bet the Pie Duck could learn it. <laughs> I really wish I had caught that Pie Duck. <laughs> I bet Panda wishes I had caught the Pie Duck too. <laughs> uh. Yeah, yeah, we're all getting buffed by the sandstorm. Alright, well... Should we do it? Nah, let's just keep lighting things on fire and kicking them in the face. Ah, you're on fire! Aw, oh, let's kick you when you're down! Now we don't even need to kick you. Because we're just watching you burn to a crisp. And we defeated the captain. Ha, ah, captain, I beat you. <laughs> Yar, swim for it, man! Ye, you pay for this! Yar. Yar, you make me super upset. Run away! Um, hi there. Hi, Wall! How are you? I am so happy to see you, Wall. Yeah, I managed to swipe this. I wasn't gonna let them have it. I mean, they're pirates, right? You want it, don't you? Okay, beat me in a battle. I just saved you! You fucking ignorant dick! Oh, you only have one? Oh, it's a level 20 turtle, too. Light it on fire. <laughs> oh, I'm almost 20 levels ahead of you. Getting a critical super effective hit. You see, man, you should have just handed it to me. Like, I just saved your life. And you're like, oh, you need to prove yourself, huh? I'm horrible. Yeah, you are. And you should feel bad, too. Fine, you win. I like how I'm staring at the wall. This will let you surf, but the town's badges needed HMO3. I'm going home. This place is spooky. Then again, I guess that's the idea. Later! And another NPC who walks into a wall. 
All right. Well, as we sit here listening to the lovely evolution music, Coco needs some healing. Yay! All right, but actually, so we have actually I should put Boston Creme back in the front because we still have one more encounter here in the sweet safari zone. We're not quite done yet. We've done three out of the four. Oh, get out of the grass. Can I even get anywhere from here? No. So we need to get our final sweet encounter. Uh, was it this way? Mm, hey, it's a cornet. So I'm guessing I have to go this way to the right. Can I go up and right? I can go up and right. God. Go away, heirloom. <laughs> I don't have time for your shit. How do I get out of here? Hmm. I want to leave. I don't think I fought you. So I guess we'll have to fight you. Who's the girl next door living in the haunted mansion? Yeah. Who is the girl next door who lives in the haunted mansion? Ashley. Gravy Palm and... Oh. Oh, that's what Strusel would have evolved into. Oh, now I'm sad. So we know that's an apple type. So let's body slam it. And all I've known from this grape type is the roars. So let's just focus on one for now. Oh, see, here we go. These people are 36 and 37. Ember. So, I mean, I would imagine that's an orange type move. Oh, goodbye, Strusel. Alright, so body slam and double kick. Just do the same thing. Bam! And bam! What is grape? Grape is weak to blue, orange, and cherry. Hmm. And raspberry resists grape, so ha <laughs> ha. Ah, uh, not enough. Body slam, double kick. You would quick attack. Ugh, that thing is weird, the more I look at it. Especially its evolution. I mean, stupid thing didn't want to join us anyway, just kept roaring at us. We defeated Ashley. I'll remember this. You remember it all you want, because you're probably never going to see me again. Ooh, is that the exit? It is, in fact, the exit. Oh, and here we go. Valentine's is the last theme. I remember the last end of the last episode. We discussed what it could be. It appears to be Valentine's. Right? We haven't got one here. We got Christmas, Easter, and Halloween. Yeah. So, our encounter for the Valentine area is actually, for once, the very first. That's that's one on this dice. <laughs> the very first encounter. So, let's see. No teasing. Just give us what we get. It's a buttercup! <laughs> Where's your cute little buttercup? Hmm, interesting. I'm gonna put the cute little buttercup to sleep. <clears throat> hmm. Buttercup fell asleep. You go ahead and sleep. Now, buttercup, I'm gonna need you to do something for me. And that is stay in the sweet ball. Just stay right there. Wiggle on in. Buttercup. <laughs> We're going to have problems if you don't stay in the ball. So here we go. I'm going to throw it lightly. Whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. Now stay. It's just going to... Oh, don't wake up. All right, fine. Buttercup, you're going to play this way. I'll throw a great ball at you then. Ready? Whoosh. Now stay in this one. It's just going to shake and shake and shake. Hey, we got Buttercup. So we did, in fact, manage to get all four of our Safari Zone encounters. That's good. Buttercup's data was added to the cookbook. Born as a larger-than-normal strawberry, it aspires to be lovely and elegant, and with care, will succeed in time. So, interesting. I'm guessing strawberry flip for them. So, I already have a nickname. As soon as I read your name, this instantly came to mind. So we're going to call you 
Powerpuff. Because <laughs> your name is Buttercup. Bye, Powerpuff. Alright, so I believe we are all done. Ooh. A full restore. Nice. Mm, we have Surf, but we need the badge. What's going on in here? How many did you catch? I'm bushed from the effort. I got an egg. That makes this all worthwhile. Ooh. Whew, I'm tired from all the fun. These guys are just a bunch of losers chilling in the house. So, I want... Oh, okay. Game froze for a second. It's like, hey, 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 hey. So, I can, oh, I can go around you. YOLO! Okay, so it's up there. I just want to get the item, because again, we're already, I'm already, well, I mean, I don't know if we're overloaded. Oh, thief. It's really hard to tell if you're overleveled in this or not. Let's just go through the grass. Oh, no, there's nothing here. Oh, we could have got a malt here. We could have brought Neggy back. Oh, well. And I really like the way that, because I know the uh, the Gardevoir in this game, it's like red, vel red velvet and is holding like a piece of red velvet cake and looks super cool. Aww. So maybe we'll get a chance. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. Oh, now, now that's all I'm... Now that's all I'm going to run into. So I believe that is it for our Savar Savari, Safari Zone Adventures. I don't think there's a reason to stick around. Except for random items. I mean, I don't think I even get that one. Yeah, I can't even get that one anyway. So, does this... Nope, that's back in the Valentine Zone. So... I don't think I even went in this house. This is the beginning. Hello. I'm catching cone or Kane's Tay Home's gifts. Congratulations. So I do believe that we are all done with the Safari Zone now. We've got Surf, which actually we should investigate to see if anyone can even learn it. Because I'm assuming we're gonna need Surf to progress. It is in fact a blue type move. Oh, Crisp can learn it. Okay, I mean, that makes sense, Blastoise. So we'll probably just teach it to Crisp then. <laughs> because why not? <clears throat> Alright, so we've explored the town. We've explored the Safari Zone. Is there, Actually, is there anyone in this town that is selling items? Because so far in each town, they've had, like, somebody was selling um, fresh water. Somebody sold lemonade. Somebody sold soda pop. Don't they have any... How about some paper lanterns? Aren't they even... I've missed the rest. Wow, tons of sweet stuff. Have you tried the pancakes here? There's pancakes here? Hello, one order of pancakes, please. So what do you got? Super potions, full heals, max repels, revives. Great balls and ultra balls, huh? Well... I don't know, because, I mean, like, again, every town has kind of had that so far, but I'm pretty sure we talked to everyone in town. I'll see him back here. He missed his cooking class, but I suppose I can overlook that. Oh, yeah, that's right. You're, yeah, I saved your son. That old man didn't have any. Hmm. <laughs> Just making sure I didn't... <laughs> Excuse me. Just making sure I didn't miss anyone. What's down this way? Milky Coast. So this is a new route. <laughs> so why don't we stay up here for now? So I guess not. But anyway, I'm going to go ahead and wrap this episode up right here. I will buy some poop soup. I will buy some super potions off screen. And then we are going to take on this gym before we move on. So if you're enjoying the series, please give that like button a nice little poke for me. Scroll on over and poke that subscribe button for more. And until next time, guys, I'll see you there.